What time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. It's right down there. Right down there. And it's time to find my Instagram, Geekly Amanda, G E E K L I Amanda, same on Twitter. And this crazy Amanda reacts on TikTok too. And it's time to get this reaction video started. Right, y'all now on digital you can get the impractical jokers new movie so it's called impractical jokers the movie and of course it stars all our impractical jokers guys you've got joe gatto and sal and q and mer and and now a little even bonus you get paula abdul's up in it paula abdul is in this one yes she uh, is it starts out that they're back in the day they were like the they snuck into this paul abdul concert being their security and all this and they really bombed the concert paul abdul was mad at them they kicked it out she was like i never forget you but for some time and now they're in the practical jokers they're doing their stuff and they they see paul abdul she doesn't recognize who they were they, they were the ones who crashed her little thing before well she recognized them though as the impractical joker people who she loved and she invited them to down in Miami to see one of her she only gave them like three tickets right she only gave them so many tickets that it wasn't enough for all of them one of them was gonna be left out so they take this road trip down there and on the way they're doing their little impractical stuff their little impractical jokes on people and and their challenges and all that stuff and whoever's the loser at the end doesn't get to go to the Paul Abdul well, let me tell you I loved it and I didn't <laughs> I did so the part, like, we'll start with the bad part. I mean, the little story, it kind of reminded you, they're not, they're not actors, you know? I mean, I guess they're impractical joker, jokesters, but they're not like TV star, movie star actors. The, their acting experience is kind of like that. And, you know, you can see it on screen when they're doing the parts that they have lines, their own lines and stuff like that. You can tell it's a little forced. And even the story, you know, the whole Paul Abdul thing, the story's kind of like a PBS. The good part is the stuff that they do excel at, their jokesters and all that, is hilarious. They took, oh, I'm telling you, they took some of their best footage in this, uh, of their little jokester stuff. They did every part when they're doing their little jokes and stuff, I was cracking. So for me, it was worth it just because I love the Impractical Jokers. I love seeing them doing the pranks on each other and challenges and, and their little jokes or stuff. And with this being some of the best footage, it was definitely the A plus in my book. I'm a huge Impractical Joker fan. You know, I love them. I love the show. I love the pranks. I even got tickets to see when they when they come on the road in, in my town to see I them. I enjoyed this. I definitely give it a thumbs up. Uh, th like thumbs up in half because you know the other part with the Paul Abdul they could have skipped that for me and just had it all in practical jokers the movie them playing if you've seen it let me know what you think comments thumbs and if not and you plan to after you come back and let me know what you thought of it till next time